and the most embarrassing loss of the season, FIU. You know what's funny? Man, I don't have the time to go back and look inside my videos and find it where I say it would be totally horrible if we ever lost to FIU. I did not see us losing to FIU. How did we lose to FIU? Somebody please tell me how we lost to FIU. That comment section is open, man. I'm ready to, I'm ready to talk to anybody right now. Now, check this out. We went to where the Orange Bowl used to stand. The Orange Bowl, where Miami used to play their home game. Right there in Coral Gables. We went there. Now, right now it's, what, Marlin, Marlin Baseball. It's the, it's the baseball stadium, god damn it. It's the baseball stadium. So we go and we play FIU. It's a home game for them. It's a home game for them. But it's in the heart of Miami. It's where the Orange Bowl used to be. It's where we used to play. We got the winning. We got the home game winning streak right there. Now, I'm looking at the game. And at halftime, I think we down, what, 13 to 0? 16 to 0? One of them. God. Why are we down to FIU in the first place? Jaron Williams, man. This was one of your worst performance of your life. If y'all thought the Virginia Tech game was horrible when he kept throwing all them picks, man, this goes beyond that. First of all, how do you lose to FIU? How does the Hurricanes of Miami lose to FIU? Now, we beat Florida State. Manny Diaz and the coaching staff look like they're starting to turn things around. We got to win at Pitt. We got to win at freaking Louisville. Jerry Williams threw six touchdowns at Louisville. So I'm thinking, and I'm pretty sure all you Miami fans, all of y'all thinking that, yo, this, go, this about to be something. We're going to win these games out. We're going to beat FIU. We're going to beat Duke. And we're going to walk into a great bowl game depending on how Wake Forest and how... Eight and four. Eight and four. Now we about to be seven and five. Maybe six and six. Maybe six and six. Now, we got one game left. We got Duke. Now, if Duke beat Miami, we will be six and six this season. Manny Diaz and Dan Enos. Y'all ain't shit, bro. Y'all ain't. If this is how y'all going to coach Miami for the next couple of years, I don't want to watch a game. I don't want to watch one game. I'll just skip the basketball season. Baseball season. Whatever, ever, whatever sports other than football that Miami plays, I will skip all season. If this is the kind of performance we should be expecting every week from y'all. Every time y'all go on a bye week, y'all come back and y'all lose. Oh, y'all look horrible. What is up with this, man? What is up with this, this inconsistency, man? I'm ashamed. I'm embarrassed. How do I go to work and face all these FSU fans, all these Gator fans who going to be talking all this mad smack? How do I defend you, man of the ass? Dan Enos. How do I defend y'all? I ain't going to... Come on, man. Manny Diaz. Jerry Williams threw those picks. You didn't give nobody else a chance. Man, let's, let's talk about it, man. Let's talk about it. Take Martell, Nicosi Perry. It is what it is. Y'all on the... Y'all... Bro, they chose Jaron from the start. No matter what y'all did, it wasn't going to stop nothing. Nicosi Perry, you had your chance... You, you stumbled along the line, but Tate, you ain't never had a chance to begin with. They, they, it is what it is, bro. Manny was set on Jaron. Now, for the past couple weeks, bro, the past couple weeks, all I've been seeing is all this great recruiting, all these great commitments we've been getting. After they see this, 
How many of them you think going to still commit or decommit from Miami? How many of them is willing to go down this road? Look at the beginning when we try to get um, Jalen Hurns. He's over at Oklahoma doing great because he got a great coach. He got great offensive coordinator behind him. We got freaking Dan Enos. We got Dan Enos. Come on, man. Come on, man. Dan Enos, you got to go, man. You got to go. I thought, I thought you were progressing. But clearly tonight showed me that you ain't ready, man. You ain't ready. You ain't down here. You ain't got that Miami pride, man. We can't lose the FIU. Not once. Now FIU is celebrating tonight. They're going to be celebrating all year. They could have went O and whatever. And they would have just beat us and they would have had a great season. You just gave them a great season. Butch Davis, I salute you, brother. I salute you. We should have hired you. Now, moving forward, because obviously we need to. <sighs> if y'all get rid of Manny Diaz, man, please get Crystal Ball over here. Please get Crystal Ball over here. Mario, please come. Please come to Miami. Deliver us. You know what? I'm pissed off. I might say some stuff that, you know what, I, I ain't taking back nothing. So, you know what? I'm going to get off of here, man. Hurricane fan, I would say y'all to have a good night, but it, it ain't going to be no good night. We ain't sleeping good tonight. Not with no 30 to 24. Bro, I'm out.